New tonight, a large fight forced a Rock Hill High School to go on lockdown. It happened this morning at South Point, and the resource officer had to call for backup. Our South Carolina Bureau reporter Greg Suskin learned police arrested several students involved. The scene is chaotic and horrifying. Students fighting just before classes started at South Point High School. The resource officer on campus immediately called for backup, and more officers came along with York County Sheriff's deputies. One of these kids are going to be um, severely hurt or killed. Chris has a daughter at South Point and didn't want to give his last name. Some students who reached out to us said there have been fights all week, calling them gang related. She said blood was all over the walls and the windows. Um, and, and a bunch of kids were just getting beat up and slammed around in the, in the school. Rock Hill police arrested eight students, all juveniles. Then as the school was locked down, they talked to other students and watched security camera video to find out if anyone else was involved. Extra officers were left on campus for the rest of the school day just as a precaution. The school district contacted all South Point parents while school was still locked down. Part of a statement sent to reporters asked for people to speak out if they believe something may happen at school. It says, we continue to work with and ask for support and cooperation from students and parents who may have information about potential disturbances so we're able to keep our school campus safe. Some parents who showed up to pick up their children were hoping to meet with school leaders and were asked to leave. Chris says he wants to help make sure this doesn't happen again. I would like to work with the school to help all the kids. Uh, I'm sure the other parents would do the same thing. In Rock Hill, Greg Suskin, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. The eight students are all charged with inciting a riot and disorderly conduct.